Hello and welcome to Yak Whack Flips. My name is Michael, your point and click adventurer, and this is episode 20 of Let's Play Tales of Monkey Island. Quick recap on the last episode we're in the belly of the beast, and there are three pirates living in here. Of course, there are. Of course, there are people living inside a. Uh, what is it? Ma uh, mammoth? Mammal? What am I talking about? Ma manatee! Manatee! And uh, yeah, we've got to convince them to join our crew. So let's go do that. Let's continue with talking with Morgan Flay and get her to Hello. go on a what date. Is it? If that all sounds bizarre, go watch the previous episode. I need you to go on another recon mission. Really? Okay, I'll do my best. It's a three-phase operation. First, you should... First, you should... Now, what was the first bit? Slyly interrogate him. Yeah, talk to him. Interrogate him. Ask him about himself. Let's figure out where this low life is from. Okay. Second, you must... Okay. Next, you must test his grip. That was hold his hands, wasn't Take it? Take his hand. Test his grip. In case it comes to fisticuffs. Okay. Lastly? Right. Now, it wasn't inspect his gums. I can either check for weapons or reflex test. Throw a rock at him. Um, I mean, check for weapons. He's going to be put his put her hands on his body. Let's go for that. Check for weapons. Give him a pat down. When things turn to duck soup, we need to know what we're facing. Okay. Okay, so... Interrogate. Test his grip. And then check for weapons. You got it. Good luck. I've got your six. Thanks. This is the one. This is the one. Hey, Noogie. How was the date? At first, I was really nervous. Yeah? But it turned out great. Brilliant. She was so into me. First, she wanted to know all about me. She was interested right off the bat. Nice. Then she made the first move and took my hand. I knew I was doing well. Second base. Mr. Big Stuff over here. And then before I knew it, she's got her hands all over me. It was awesome. The perfect date. Glad to hear it went well. So I've got your vote. Certainly. Oh man, I'm putting all of this in my journal. I even found a strand of a hair on my vest. That's going in too, as a keepsake. Getting creepy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry. Getting creepy. Okay, so one down, two to go. Oh, three to go, isn't there? Because there's this skeleton dude here, which I've got the head of Murray. Which I did, you know, I kind of passed up last time, but it's Murray. For true evil. Maybe I have to chop his head off. Uh, it's getting dark again. Uh, yeah, let's try and chop his head off. Oh, maybe it's gonna Whoa. work. What are you doing, bro? Hmm. Right. Okay. Maybe I have to distract him with this, and then chop his head off. <laughs> I'm lopping Santi Santina's head off. Uh, that one. I uh, saw a spider on Santino here. Don't harm a creature of the manatee, oh, bro. Man. Santino doesn't mind. He loves bugs. He loves bugs, man. Uh, right, I think I'm gonna funny about with this. Come on, waste not, want not, bro. Okay, so now he's the doing something with that. Lonely in here. Whoa! No. What are hmm. you doing, bro? Okay, let's do, do these other other dialogue options. I was gonna give Santino a quick shave. I don't think so. He's pretty particular about his hair. Ladies can't get enough of it. Right. Let's just try this last dialogue option. I don't think it's gonna work, but why not? Eh? Whoa! What are you doing, bro? I'm lopping off his head. No big deal. <laughs> You're wild, dude. But easy with the sword play. Santino's the only person who knows any first aid. <laughs> okay, so we have to distract him somehow. Ooh. Oh, that's the name of him, isn't it? Moose. Let's talk to Moose Hi. then. Sir. See if we can distract him somehow. Tell me about the icon. Oh, the icon, yeah. Somebody in the comments said, because I don't know what icon was. Apparently it's like the, the basically stomach bile. Um, which is, um, yeah, tasty. Oh, yeah, let's do this. It's a special occasion. Righteous. What's the occasion? It's a Tuesday. Oh, it is Tuesday. Fruit Tuesday. Fruit I'm recording Tuesday. this on a Tuesday as well. Okay. Now he's now he's distracted. Let's whack Come his head back. off. Yes. B. 
bingo. Alright, now quickly. Hey Moose, did you know it's Hug and Otter Day? No way! That deserves a drink! <laughs> Maury's not going to like this. Or maybe he is. Maybe he's going to love it. <laughs> Three wood, you have made the greatest mistake of your life. In my new corporeal form, I will scorch these lands to the ground, only to rebuild them in my nefarious almighty image. Oh, you like your new setup? I do. Santino, bro, you want to spot me on this one? Men pledge their allegiance to me. Our brotherhood is a bond forged in the flames of hell. North. Perhaps I will revel in this union of brothers for a moment. Before burning the world. Terror will come to this manatee, <laughs> rest assured. That's one of the lines of the game. Terror will come to this manatee. <laughs> uh, right, so if we've got his vote, hey I presume there, we've got his vote. Is Santino? Aloha. <laughs> Aloha. Think I can get your vote into the Brotherhood? We are very selective of our members. I just scammed your way in 15 seconds ago. How about a nod for the effort? Okay, okay, sure thing, Creepwood. Okay, cool. Um, arr. Oh, we need to get the face stats right. The, the third guy, or should I say fourth guy, we need to get different faces to have a face off. Arr. <laughs> your contorted cast couldn't scare a schoolgirl. In my day, I could turn a man to stone with a smirk. I can make blood boil with a scowl, and all I need is a reason. And lips. <laughs> and lips. You actually like these guys? Like? I like no one, but I love the Brotherhood. What I have here is a group of men I can mold in my own image. Their fates are tied to mine, and my fate leads to the highest throne of hell. So Brotherhood actually suits you. Plus, Bug Eye is working on a creed. I love creeds. Right, last one. I know it doesn't really mean anything, but I like Murray talking to him. How's the body treating you? Remarkably well. It's only a matter of time before I gain control of my limbs. <laughs> oh boy. Then we're in for it. I shall rewrite your definition of misery. You're literate now, too? Not completely. <laughs> okay. See you later, Murray. Talk to you later, Murray. Take care, windbag. <laughs> a bit harsh. Uh, exit to mouth. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll probably have to go to see um, the other dude up there. To, to Carver? To, to Carver? That's I think that's his name, wasn't it? Right, let's go and see how many other faces we can find. Right, pile of treasure. Is there a face? Festive skull. Did we do that one? Hey there. Hmm, okay. there now what right give me the skinny about the missing cochlea we have both me to the brotherhood call a vote right he's not gonna do it you're a real killjoy you're a real killjoy I don't take kindly to ruffians messing with the dynamics of the brotherhood aren't you a bit like the tyrants you claim to hate I don't appreciate your inference sweet roll we do everything democratically down here Noogie, Moose, and Santino carry equal weight in every decision. How about your decision to be a jerk? No, that one's all me. I just want him to get put. My, I just want him to pull a face. Fish Eyes Alabaster, renowned philosopher or spooky old man who lived at the end of the lane. Fish Eyes was the first to see the honor in mutineering. He was a professional lookout for many years until the strain ruptured his optic nerves. It ruined his face, but expanded his mind. Never worked another day in his life. We soldier on in his memory. I don't I don't remember that conversation about that. But um yeah, let's do this anyway. Let's go another round. Haven't had enough yet, Dollface. Maybe I'll learn some more from him by Ready? doing this. I'll go first. It's the Arr. Stinky, lazy eyed, meany. That's what we did before, wasn't it? Did you Stinky. do a face yet? I just see general disfigurement. Now check this out. Now we've got to do the nasty, lazy-eyed monkey. Just pick him randomly. He's got the arr, nasty, lazy-eyed monkey. Well, ah! 
<laughs> fresh moves, but not enough. Partial originality is as good as none at all. Bug Eye wins. Oh, no. You've got nothing, boy. I'm just warming up. Can we try it again? Oh, I don't. Hmm, I'm not going to try it again. Okay, I'm going to go see if I can find any more around here. Let's have a look what's around here. Oh, what was that? We need to we need to clean Orchard this or something. Fish eyes alabaster. It's covered with oh, ancient right. yeah, 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 I can't yeah, yeah, see yeah. it painted. I get it, I get it. That's fish eyes alabaster, which is gonna have a face on it, isn't it? But we've got to clean it, maybe we clean it with a grub. Every grub I waste is one more I'll have to pick up for Dacaba. Oh, so that's why I've got the grubs. I should really pay attention to what's going on in this game. Let's use that with this cover. This member's manual seems too important for that. Okay. So Iron Monkey. Have we looked at the Iron Monkey? Can't reach it. Okay. Let's go to clogged. This is the one that we can't get through. Stops us there. Something there. Maybe we have to put something something down there. What have we got that we can put down there? Maybe the sword? I don't want to cut that. No. Maybe the bog. It's not gonna work, is it? Every grub I waste. Yeah, okay. I'm assuming that might pop up here. Yeah, odd protuberance. So if we declog that, we'll go up there and probably get maybe another face. I don't know. I reckon I'm going to go back to Decarva if I can. But there was an exit there, wasn't there? Come on, run, guy, brush. I am pressing the run button, but it's not not running. Oh, let's see what her outcome of of the date was. Hey, Mo, what is it? I need to infiltrate the Brotherhood and find the missing cochlea. Sounds like a personal problem. <laughs> All right. Thanks very much for your help. Okay. I'll be back later. Take your time. Pretend wives sure are fickle. I wonder what my real wife is up to. Probably pining away for her mighty pirate husband. There's something about the open ocean that makes a man feel alive. I would imagine that simply having a pulse is a bit of an upgrade for you. <coughs> How many more of these filthy creatures do we need to unload before we can meet up with Guybrush? Dozens. Seven more islands and one peninsula should suffice. Seven? Listen, Chucky. Drop all the simians on the next patch of dirt we pass and then we find my husband. We can't do that, Elaine. These monkeys need to be given proper homes, far apart from each other, for their comfort and happiness. That ship's can roast on an open flame for all I care! Elaine? You don't mean that. Oh, I'm so sorry. You're right. I do apologize, monkeys. Lush homes all around. I do apologize for the inconvenience. No need to apologize. Actually, it's crazy to say this, but I'm proud of you. Really? Look at you, going out of your way to set things right. Who ever thought LeChuck would do such a thing? It's only the beginning. Wow. That was the, um, yeah, I'm not sure about this whole Chuck thing. Alright, have we gone up to the carver yet? The carver, sorry, not the carver. The Chuck, ah, the carver. Hand. Could you do me a favor? Shoot. I'm parched. I would love a drink, but none of that yellow muck, dangerous stuff that is, makes my eyes go wilder than a frothing Pomeranian. Okay, one drink coming up. So I reckon I need to get that yellow drink for him. Anyway, let's carry on. Let's give him a bug. I forgot what we need to give him bugs for. Splendid! You found a manatee throat grub. Let's build a cochlea. That's the plan. Only ninety-nine thousand <laughs> nine hundred and ninety-nine left. Uh, come again? 
Each grub yields such a small amount of usable husk. By calculations, I'll need another hundred thousand. <laughs> right. This is no laughing matter, Three Willow. We don't have time to collect that many grubs. On the contrary, time is all we do have. Rest assured, it will all pay off in the end. This is bananas. New plan. Find the actual cochlea. So we gotta find the cochlea. Dakava's plans to rebuild the manatee's inner ear, or cochlea. They're remarkably comprehensive, considering they were drafted by a whack job. Can I pick them up or anything? No. What else is here? Anything? File trunk. A steamer trunk. It's probably full of junk. Or secrets. <laughs> or oh, secrets. What's that? Cochlea shark. Dakava's homebrewed cochlea. It should be ready in a decade or so. Oh, that's one he's making with all these grubs. Fair enough. Looks like Dakava's managed to collect quite a few grubs already. Only a few more decades of grub hunting to go. The car was camp. Ooh, where's Minimalistic, he going? Minimalistic, airy, with a warm layer of mucus. I really love what Takafa's done with the place. Looks cool. I like it. Ooh, ooh what's, what's that? Someone was coughing in there. Oh, there's a grub. I'll get it in a minute. Everything okay in there? Most certainly, sir. I'm just relaxing with a glass of warm milk. Okay. Oh dear. He does that well, does he? Poorly man. Right, let's go get that grub. A manatee throat grub. And I guess this is what Dakaba is after. I'm not going around collecting 999,000 grubs. Because that's silly. Right, let's go up here and see if we can get in the ship. And then what I'll do is I'll go down... And fill that cup with the mucus of the the belly of the beast. Okay, so I'm on here. Can I fire the cannon? The narwhal's cannon. While it lacks firepower, it does look scary. No, we can't. Main mast. Did we do this? We went up. Yeah, we did. <coughs> I don't remember why, but I'm doing it again anyway. Oh, this is where the earwax was, and it's pretty gross. Oh, there's the actual cochlea. While it may look like it's full of candy, I believe the cochlea is key to this manatee's sense of direction. Okay, so how do we get it? We no wonder this guy is swimming in circles. He's missing half of his internal navigation system. Mm, okay. Can I swipe it? Uh, besides causing needless damage and pain, removing this cochlea to replace the other wouldn't make much sense. Oh, I see. So that's the cochlea of the distance. Oh, it's just the, the way that's the way that it's um, drawn. I guess you could say the way. Yeah. So that's one. We need another one here. Mm, fine. 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 Let's go down. Main mast. So I'll try and get inside the ship if I can. See Winslow. Winslow, sir. And if I can't do that, then I will go and fill up the everything the okay in there. Most certainly, sir. I'm just relaxing with a glass of warm milk. <laughs> okay. Warm milk. Lovely. Can I go around the back? And up? No, I can't. Okay. I think. Now, we've got two choices. I can either go and fill his cup up with what he's asked for. How do I get off the boat? There we go. Or fill it up with the yellow stuff. Double click. Come on, Guybrush, run. We could try both. Hey you, Rabble Rouser. Yes? Are you enjoying your time with the Democratically United Brotherhood of the Manatee Interior? How can I not? Can't wait to be voted in. We'll see about that. In the meantime, I don't want any trouble. We got it nice and easy down here. Okie dokie. Just some friendly advice. Don't be poking around up top and stay away from Dakava. The last thing this manatee needs is his sense of direction restored. We don't need to be getting to any sacred mating grounds. Seriously. I've never seen manatees mate before, but I'm pretty sure I don't want to be inside one when I do. I'm glad we're on the same page. He is a nasty pasty, isn't he? Right, let's go and fill this cup up. First, let's fill it up with what I've got here. I, I still, still keep going to the top to get my inventory out. It's not, it's not right. 
Right, let's use that with that. Yeah, bro. Glad to see you're indulging. Okay. Oh, maybe I can. Hmm, let's go this way. Well, I'll, I'll go over here and give it to him. But I'm thinking, if I, do, if I do fill it with a yellow icor, then I could perhaps pour it into into the things that, are, like the travel system that I keep getting stuck at. Um, right, let's have a look at it first. One mug of safe to drink orange icor. Ugh. Okay, this isn't gonna do anything, is it? Ah, a mug full of the bily bubbly. <laughs> the bily bubbly. Refreshing. All right, let's talk to him and see if it opens up any dialogues. Yes, Grumman. Oh, I need to get his his face. Arr. Why was that nonsense? A pirate face. Intimidating. Arr. I am an explorer and esteemed adventurer. I don't do those sort of things. Oh, not even a little. Not even a little. Ah, oh, come on, I bet you do. Thing about your crew. Oh, my crew. Say no more. I don't want to get emotional in front of a new crew member. Oh, other cries haunt my dreams. What do you want me to do, Captain? I'm parched. I would love a drink, but none of that yellow muck, dangerous stuff that is, makes my eyes go wilder than a frothing Pomeranian. Okay, one drink coming up. Okay, I'm going to do that in a minute. You need 100,000 of these grubs to build one cochlea? By my calculations, yes. This is going to take forever. You know that, right? Forever? No. Several years, yes. An ardent adventurer must maintain his focus over the long game, Grumman Triput. Huh? What was that? <laughs> what you doing? I'm working on the replacement inner ear, and you should be finding me my materials. Great. Grubs. All right then. Take care. Come on then, three weed. Let's go and get some more. Ooh, I didn't see that before. Mm, manatee uvula. Well, it's a delicacy in some cultures. Let's see if I can stab it. Stab all I the things. I don't think so. I've always lived by the rule: do unto others uvulas as you would have done to yours. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go and get some yellow eye core. That looks fun. Sounds a bit greasy. Come on then, guy brush. Let's get this going a bit faster. Are those manatee flesh bongos? Yeah, they produce a great sound. I think it's because they're full of bile. Maybe it doesn't work that way with people. Noogie, my man. Right, play it fast. Play it fast. There you go. I like the beat. How about something a little more up tempo? Like this? I dig it. Okay. Now I don't know whether this is going to change what we get out of here, but we're going to give it a go anyway. Yeah, bro. Glad to see you're indulging. Oh, maybe maybe that's not right because that was the same. That's still orange, wasn't it? No, I don't want to go that way. How do we get to the bile shipwreck? It's gone down again. Has he gone down? Have I done it too slow? Do I have to do it fast, do you reckon? Pool of bile. A pool of acidic yellow bile. Let's use that with that. The level's too low to take a sample. Oh, no. Right, okay. Let's go quick. We've got it. We can do this. We just need to be faster. Right, I don't want to go. I want to go there. Doogie, my man. Yeah, skip dialogue. Play something fast, please. Like the beat. How about something a little more up tempo? Like this? I know. I've got it. I've got it. I dig it. I don't need to run at all. I need to jump in the um in this thing. Why wouldn't he do that? I mean, why wouldn't he do that? Now, quick. Ah, a bit quicker, guy. Brush. Yes. One Get cup in. of horribly corrosive, ultra toxic manatee bile. Delish. <laughs> right, let's go. I'm gonna give this to to cover. 
again, he doesn't. He doesn't run in the in this bit. He doesn't run. Doesn't matter how much, like <laughs> how hard I'm pressing the shift key, <laughs> I runs up. Right, let's give him that drink and see what happens. Your mug, sir. I thought I told you, no yellow. Oh, no. Nice. Other flavors are for wimps. Are you trying to kill me? I told you, I lose complete ocular control. Right. Okay. So we've got the, we've got it at least. What do we do with it? Maybe we put that on there. Oh, that's not how you combine it. That on there? No. Hmm. Maybe the bug. Changes colour. No. Okay, so we have a, a mug of bile. Brilliant. I've got to give it to the cover, I think. But we're going to do all of that in the next episode. So um, if you've enjoyed today, as always, please leave a like. I really appreciate it. And until next time, have a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is you're doing right now. And take care.